Hey guys, and welcome back to uh, another part of my Pokemon Hacking Tutorial Remix. This is part number 7, and we're doing Orange GBA Basic Usage. Uh, in the future I'll make more guides on this, just so you have to do different things. So, yeah. Here's a tutorial of ROM. As you can see, if you look through Orange GBA, basically it's all the images in the game. If you click next, there's loads of random ones here. But I'm just going to show you a few of them, I'm not going to show you them all. But I think uh, 1500, I think, is it? Yeah, is Trainer Sprites here. As you can see, 2,000, oops, uh, maybe not, 1,000 then, is Pokemon sprites, so around there, you've got the front sprite, and then you've got back shiny sprite, so, I don't know what that's about, but yeah. So, the thing we're going to do is we're going to get to 120, I think, uh, actually 121, and you click image offset plus, I think, 256 color mode, no, Just gonna go and check which actually um which one I want. There's loads on here. Just see if I can go through and find it. Okay, I pause this. Sorry about that, guys. Um, I couldn't really find it. I don't know. I don't know what it was about. But yeah. Okay. So the um to the example I'm gonna show in this video, as I did in the uh, original, is the game freak symbol that comes across the screen at the start of the um the game. You know when it goes like. Doo -doo. Okay. So if you go to two eleven on the Pokemon Fire Red ROM. Uh, and you look over here on the left hand side you've got a jumble of letters you can't really edit that can we so if you click plus plus again plus again you've got a game freak see uh, now if we click use black and white it's turned into black and white but I'm going to keep it on 16 color mode 256 color mode doesn't really work so yeah. now to edit this you have to click save as save it anywhere so I'm going to call this game freak doesn't matter where you save it save that and then I'm going to open it on Paint. Okay, guys. All right, guys. As you can see, I've opened this on Game Freak um, on Paint, the Game Freak symbol here. So the first thing you want to do is you want to keep it the same size. So I'm just going to extend this so you can see that. Now you want to note down, take a slot of the colours used. You don't necessarily have to do this for all of them, but I'm doing it for this one. Uh, that's pretty much all of the colours apart from the blue. And then you want to get rid of what? Uh, get rid of all of this. So yeah. Uh, and then we get rid of this down here. Now the thing you can do is you can go in paint, you can go uh, to zoom out though, don't you? Zoom again. And you can use the text. So click text. Uh, anywhere on the map, uh, anywhere on the map. Uh, and then you can set your font. I'm going to use Free Cat Go Bananas. Where is it there? Uh, and I'm going to type Mega Poker Mate. Well, alright, of course. Extend that. Maniac. Okay, as you can see, I can make it a bit bigger there, so I'll just highlight that. And bring it up to 10, 11, or more than 12. Okay. 14. And then extend this a bit more. Okay, guys, so as you've done that, you want to zoom in, and as you can see, you've got your text. Now, some of this is obviously a bit unusual. Uh, So you want to do there we are. Just about fits on that. So I'm just gonna zoom in again. Hopefully I haven't got rid of any of that there. Uh, just make like that a second colour. Just so it doesn't dislodge any of it. And I'm going to move that down there. One place. Okay. So as you can see there I've got my thing. I'm just gonna select the blue because I know as you can see Text, certain text I'm using is a bit blurry, so you want to make some holes just for the centers and stuff. Like that, control Z, put it there instead. Uh, yep. Meg, uh, A. Yeah, some text on paint does go a bit funny, so you have to go through and correct it. But the most crucial thing about doing well, this one especially, is you do not extend the file. I don't think it would work. So yeah. 
So Mega Poke Air Egan Me A N Mani Egan and then C. So as you can see that's fairly legible. You might want to take it a bit longer on it than I have, but it doesn't really matter. So then you want to extend it down to exactly the same size as it was before. I'm not sure if this matters, but you know, just be on the safe side. And then we file save. Now we switch back to the orange GBA. Alright guys, we're back on the orange GBA, so now we've got to click import. And we've got we've saved it obviously the same thing, and here you can see Mega Pick Maniac. Now you click right to ROM on the right hand side. Uh, export image oh, da, 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 okay. And obviously it hasn't done anything, so we're good. So click file and that's pretty much it. Uh, and that should work now. So now we're gonna open up uh, on VBA to have a little look, little, little look at it. Alright guys, so we're here on the VBA and I've paused it at the moment just so you can see it now. Uh we click unpause. It should play, obviously. So here's where it usually comes across it says Game Freak underneath it. But instead we have got Mega Pokemaniac. Obviously my little my uh, letters are a bit fucked up, but yeah, and it's not centered. But yeah. So thank you for watching guys. I hope you enjoyed the video. I'll see you next time. Goodbye. That's basically you on GBA usage. Bye guys.